Hello, my name is Carol Hughes. I've owned and operated custom costumes and tailor-made for 25 and 30 years. Uh, today I'm going to teach you some basics in ironing. Okay, this is how you go about pressing a military shirt. In the old days they used a lot of starch. I'm not so sure they use it much anymore, especially in the days of permanent press. I begin a shirt with the under collar, then I flip it over and do the upper collar. Then I proceed to the yoke. After that, I go to the sleeves. And I usually fold it, you know, right where the seam is and press from there your cuff. And of course you use an appropriate setting for the type of fabric it is. After the sleeves, I proceed with the body of the shirt, beginning with the facings. And I think only the Navy and Marines require the uh, extra little f pressings. So to do those, you would divide the back of your shirt in half. press it up the center back and then you would match the s side seam to that pressed fold So to put the third crease in, again, determine the center point between the shoulder and the center. Again, line it up on the straight of the fabric. And press. For the front, again, you divide it in half. Probably run straight through the center of the pocket. Up to the shoulder. And repeat on the other side. And that's how you press a military shirt. 